The LA City Council has voted to extend a ban on people sleeping in their cars in residential neighborhoods. CBS NLA's Randy Page, he's joining us now in downtown LA with the very latest development on this controversial issue. Randy. Jasmine, let me set this up because you're about to see some interesting video that we took just about an hour ago, or less than that, I should say, inside the council chambers. Now, as you mentioned, the city of Los Angeles has an ordinance in place which simply says if you are homeless, you will not be allowed to sleep in your car in residential areas or near schools. The matter before the council today is whether or not that ban should be extended for another six months. Now, a yes vote would mean yes, the ban should be extended. You are about to hear the vote, and then you will see the reaction. 13 ayes. Okay, this item passes. Let's move on to item 31. Now, what happened just before this huge reaction is we watched as more than 30 people got up to speak before the council. Each and every person who spoke was clearly saying the homeless should be allowed to stay in residential areas. So it really did appear to come as a surprise. So why did the council vote so strongly to continue this ban? Here's one of the council members, Joe Buscaiano. But as far as this specific vote went, what made you decide to go ahead and vote yes? Well, we need to have some order in our city, you know, and I feel that it's it's just and the fact that, you know, you can't live in a car in a residential area. We have to keep in mind that there are property owners who are freaking out when you have people living in their cars in front of their home. So I support the residential ban on sleeping in vehicles in residential areas. Well, before it was all over, one person, as you can see, was taken into custody for disrupting the proceeding. We noticed that she was released just a short time later. But it is clear there are strong feelings about that in this city. And to be fair, I must say that there are a number of people in the communities, as you can well imagine, who are concerned about members of the homeless community sleeping near schools and in residential areas. Those are the people that the council member was talking about. So as it stands right now, the ban will remain, while the council members now have to come to grips with what to do with these folks who don't have any other place to stay. Councilmember Buscayano and others have said they are working on places for people to stay where they can safely stay. And there have, are designated areas around the city and some of the business areas and other areas where they are allowed to be. But as it stands right now, they will not be allowed in residential areas. Let's go back to you, Jasmine. Yeah, very controversial. Randy, you've reported extensively on the crisis that we see out there with our homeless population. You mentioned, you know, making parking lots available. Do you know if any more are in the works? Are they going to add more church parking lots, these certain designated areas? Because it's a challenge. You know, it absolutely is a challenge, not for just the city of Los Angeles, but for all of Southern California. And yes, there are a number of different options that are being considered. I'll throw out one. Uh, there already are a number of motels which will accept vouchers, county vouchers, to pay for homeless to stay. Well, now the county's looking into the idea of leasing out whole blocks of rooms or even entire motels and then taking the parking lots for those motels and turning those into places where safe places for the homeless community who are living in cars could park their cars to stay. Mm. So they are trying to find locations, designated locations, for people to be able to sleep in their cars, hopefully with toilet facilities and uh, more amenities. But as it stands right now, the sheer numbers are overwhelming, and that's why so many people are in need, and that's why you're seeing the reaction that we saw in city councils today. Yeah.